What's up guys, this is Blue Cave Aviation 24 here coming at you with airport update number 35. And in this airport update I will be mentioning some stuff and also um, some new, another new airport. So yeah, let's get started. In the baggage cuts are on the runway. So let's start here right on the runway anyway. So we got a JetBlue A320 in the Blue Bear's tail. He's he, he just landed and is jetting down the runway, slowing down, and he's gonna be pulling off the runway. But he came in from. He came in from um, Long Beach. Uh, we'll go right here. So turning around to taxi to the runway, we got a Norwegian 737 -8. 8 max, this guy's gonna be heading out to? He's gonna be heading out to Oslo. Right here we got a United 767-300 pushing back for his flight out to. Right uh, he's gonna be heading out to San Francisco. Right here we got a Caribbean 737-800. I'm just fixing them. Um, he taxied off the runway from his flight out to, um, um, Sangster International, and he's going to be heading out to it. Uh, he's going to be heading out later to Port of Spain. Right here, we got um, a JetBlue A321 uh, 200S in the Prism's tail. He's going to be heading out to. He's going to be. Well, he came in from Sacramento, Dominican Republic, and will be heading out to LEX. Wait, actually, we're going to go here because this one technically is still on the taxiway. It hasn't fully pulled in. We got a Delta 757200 pulling into its gate from. He's coming in from um, Salt Lake City. Right here, taxiing to its gate, which is Alpha 5. We got a MRX 777300ER in the 2014 World Cup livery. He's going, he came in from Dubai. Kind of from waiting to taxi to its gate, currently waiting for the A380 to taxi onto the runway. We have a Delta 737-800. Um, this guy came in from Harbor City International, or JJW Aviation's airport, and will be heading out to Seattle. Right here we got a Delta, I mean no, this guy's not heading out to Seattle, this guy's going to be heading out to um, Fort Lauderdale. I mean Fort Myers. Yeah, Fort Lauderdale. Right here we got a Delta 737-900, this guy came in from Boston. I mean no, not Boston. Uh, came in from Miami and will be heading out to Seattle. That one's heading out to Seattle. Alright, here we got a um, Emirates Airbus A380 Expo England Rugby 2015 World Cup. This guy is going to be heading out to Dubai. Actually, he's going to be heading out to Abu Dhabi. For today. He's covering for Etihad. So, um, right here we got a United Q400. He's waiting to taxi onto the runway for his fly out, too. Uh, he's going to be heading out. To um, Memphis. Behind him, we got an Alaskan 737 900 in the honor of those who serve, waiting to taxi to head out to. Uh, he's gonna be heading out to <coughs> Anchorage. Behind him, we got a Delta Connection CRJ um, 200. He's waiting to taxi for his flight out to. He's gonna be heading out to. Um, uh, you can make up with before this one. Um, I'm going to make him do a short flight out to New York, Liberty. Right here we got a um, Delta Connection CRJ900. This guy is going to be heading out to Tampa. Now I'm making my way around. Making my way around. Okay. Alright, so right here we got the Alaskan 737-900 in the 100 years strong. This guy's going to be heading out to? He's going to be heading out to Seattle. 
and back here we have some aircraft so we have uh, another Alaskan 737-900 and the more to love he's pushing back for his flight out to he got to be heading out to Portland um hold on yeah there we go we got an Alaskan 737-700 um in a new livery taxiing to the runway for his flight out to he gotta be heading out to Seattle. And right there, we got a United um, 737 900 in the Eco Skies heading out to Northern Virginia International or Southwest 252's airport. Yeah. And then from there, he's gonna head out to? Uh, he's gotta be heading out to Phoenix. Alright, guys, so now on to the. Alpha Gate. Oh wait, oh, we almost forgot another one taxi. We got a Delta um, Connections E145 taxiing to the runway. Well, he's taxiing by the British terminal, but he's going to be taxiing to the runway for his flight out to um, Portland, Maine. Alright guys, now time for the Alpha Gates. So here we have a temporary subscriber route. I don't know, um, Gemini just Bros for life. Let me know in the comment section down below. Is this route still active or is it no longer active? So we have the Delta um, A350-900 heading out to Rice Rock International or Gemini Bros for Life Airport. And he came in from Rome. Alpha 1 is empty, which is where United pushed back. Alpha 2, we have a United 747 at a charter delivery. He's going to be heading out to Tokyo Narita. Um, Alpha 3 is empty. Alpha 4 is where the Delta is pulling in. And Alpha 5 is where Emirates is pulling in. Going around again. Alpha 6 is empty. Yeah, Alpha 6 is empty. Alpha 7, we have a KLM um, 777-300 in the Orange Pride livery. This guy is going to be heading out to? He's going to be heading out to Amsterdam Schiphol. Uh, Alpha 8, we have an, oh, also, um, um, let me know in the comment section down below, if you do have a route with, um, with, um, Aviation Holland, Aviation Holland, or if you have an Amsterdam, um, airport, can you please reach out to me, and, um, ask for a subscriber for this one, because I've been asking Aviation Holland, but he hasn't responded, so I don't know if, it's because of where he's located, but it's just not going through or something. I don't know. But anyway, on with the update. At Alpha 8, we have a Latam Airbus 350. He's going to be, he's loading up to head out to Rio. Hey, can we move to Okay, he's going to be heading out to Santa Paulo instead. He came in from Rio. Right here, the Bravo Gates is empty right here. And this Bravo Gate is also empty, so Bravo 1 and 2 are empty. So Bravo 3, we got an American um, A321 he's going to be heading out to. Well, he came in early from Boston and will be heading out to LAX lately. I mean, like, pretty soon. Right here, we got uh, American Airlines um, 737-800 in the Reno Heritage he's going to be heading out to. He's going to be heading out to Phoenix, and he came in early from Miami. Okay, Bravo four and six. I mean, five and six are empty. Bravo seven. We have. We have a JetBlue A three twenty in the high rise tail. He's going to be heading out to. He's going to be heading out to um. Um, Houston, Texas. Um, Bravo eight, Bravo nine, is empty. Bravo ten is. Had the plane there, and Bravo 11 is empty. So, Bravo 10, this was an overnighter. We, but he's going to be leaving soon once these planes have cleared his area. But we got an American um, 737-800 in the One World Close scheme. He's going to be heading out to St. Kitts. And now, the only Charlie gate. Anyway, 
So Charlie one, Charlie two, Charlie three, Charlie four A is empty. Charlie four B four B is not empty. We got a um Air Canada seven eighty seven dash eight in the new color scheme. He's gonna be heading out to Toronto Peterson. Yeah, he came early from Wednesday. Yep. Onto the re onto the hard stance. We have a Virgin America A three twenty one. Neo, he um came in from Northern Virginia International or Southwest two five or Southwest two five two's airport, and we'll be heading out to LAX. Hey, why would we call this like the um, Delta Gates, and this will be? No, like this is the hard shoulder. Okay. Anyway, guys, so um, regional stands are empty. Right here, we at Fox Shop One, we have a British Airways seven eighty seven dash eight. He's going to be heading up to London Heathrow. Next to him, we have uh, American seven eighty seven dash nine. At Fox Shop One, I mean Two, and he's going to be heading out to Rice Rock International or Germany Bros for Life Airport, and he came in earlier from. London Heathrow as well. Right here we got a version Atlantic 747-400. He's going to be heading out to London Heathrow also as non-stop service. A lot of Heathrow flights at this time. Alright guys, so that concludes for that Wait. part of the airport. Sorry. And that part of the airport update. So what I wanted to show you was this little airport. So... My brother made this as a charter airport only, so you'll only see charter airport airplanes here. There is no route for this, so none of these planes have routes because there's. I don't think anyone would want a route because they're so small. I don't think anyone has some of these planes. This wasn't released in 1 to 400. This was, but not a lot of people have it, and none of these were released. But anyway... We have an American Eagle Q100. He's going to be heading out to? He's going to be heading out to Philadelphia. And then right here we have a Delta Connections. He, I mean, Sab. Sab 340. He's going to be heading out to? He's going to be heading out to New York LaGuardia. Right here we got a Gulfstream 500 private liner. He's not going anywhere. Right here we got a Smart Gulfstream 600. He's going to be heading out to? He's going to be heading out. To Miami. Next time we got the A65, um, which is actually, I know what type of plane this is. This is actually a Beechcraft 160, I think. Yeah, I think it's a Beechcraft 160. Um, this guy is going to be, this is Express Jet, he's going to be heading out too. Not like um, an airport that's nearby Montauk on an island, I don't know which one is close by. Edwards. Yeah, Edwards. Edwards Field. And um, right here we got a family Cessna 208. Um, this guy is going to be heading out too. He could be heading out to Providence, Rhode Island. And also, this airport is um, Newport, New York International. Well, Newport, New York Airfield, which is a training. Is a it's like half training airfield, half public. Yeah, half commercial use airport, but there's only like two small airlines that land there, which include Delta and American, and United lands there sometimes, I think, with their beach craft. But other than that, these are the only two. But mostly it's just private jets and stuff like that. It's like a private jet airport. This is just part of, like, part of it, though. No, this is actually kind of the full scale of it, if you think about it. It's really small. The airport's not that large, but, um, anyway, guys, let me know if you want any routes with the aircraft going to be nice to zoom up from a distance away from the airport. See all the aircraft. We're at the British bound terminal. Can't really see them over the building. See British Airways right there. Oh, my goodness. Can I get you a tail shot? There you go. You see Virgin, American, and British. Very nice tail shot, actually. 
But anyway, guys, that concludes for this airport update. Okay. Hope you guys like, um, su subscribe if you didn't, um, leave a <clears> like down below. Also, comment if you want to root, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.